Hey guys. <laughs> hey guys, it's um, Audrey and Matt here. So we're gonna do every Monday a little segment called Marriage, maybe we should call it McClelland Marriage Monday. Every Monday? We're gonna do it every, once a week, I told you we're gonna. <laughs> do you want me to just talk the whole time? You just wanna yeah, you can talk the whole time. look down at me? Um, Matt's a good sport, right? Well, it's Tuesday. Tuesday's gonna, we can do something else. So weekends are kinda like a daily video. Mondays will be Marriage Monday. Are you just planned out already? I have it planned out. Right? So I'm on board. Matt's on board. Uh, Matt has a new blog. You want to say, well, not a new blog, but Matt's been blogging. What's the name of it? Sorry, I'm rubbing my eyes. Uh, <laughs> Redefining Dad. Redefining Dad. So um, the lighting keeps catching me. I'm, I'm, I'm glowing. Is that, a, is that a good glow? Okay, so today's topic is going to be, oh, I should have gotten it on the bulletin board. Can you scream to one of the kids to get it? Hey, Ben. This is what this is what we're down. So Mother's Day, rightfully so, um, for men is I feel probably a lot of pressure, at least for the husbands. Correct? You're not my mother officially. But see, that's I don't think that that counts. Just because I am not your mother, we have five kids that are young. My mom would have appreciated this. <laughs> anyway, so this is what I got for Mother's Day. So um, Mother's Day morning, you know, I come downstairs and Matt was like, listen, sit down. We have a video for you. So I was like, oh, my God, they, they made a video. They took time. So, you know, it comes up and, you know, it was you burning bacon on a grill. Right. And it was Matt saying, you know, hey, listen, like, you know, I tried to you were away and I was trying to do like the, the cooking and the cleaning and the homework done. And it, it was like really going great because I actually started to get choked up because you were like. And then I thought to myself, mom does this every single day and doesn't like complain about it. Like extremely thoughtful, right? It was extremely yeah. thoughtful, extremely thoughtful. And then so at the, at the then the kids started to come in and everybody's saying something really nice like mom we love you so much we want to help you do what we can do um so i thought the way it was going you guys were sending me away on a vacation i was looking for like a packed bag i'm like uh, they really get it like they they understand that i like i'm like i work hard and i'm doing things and i'm doing everything i can to keep this family moving and you know what like maybe just like a checkout would be like a nice gift for like two or three days. Well, we were working on that for your birthday, so. Well, I, yes, well, that, I booked that after Mother's Day. For Mother's Day, we got you a chore chart. Now, when I've told people this, they originally think that you gave me a chore chart. No, I, I'm trying to take stuff off her plate, so I made a list of things that the boys can do to help her out. Not well received. Well, this is why it wasn't well received, okay? And I'm not even trying to be like a poop head, but. Well, essentially, I want the ladies out there to listen to me and my perspective. So this chore chart over here, it says William, Alex, Ben, Henry, and then across the top, it's every day of the week. Now, my thought process was when we moved in, oh goodness, here we go. When we moved in, is that, I, I just got a glare. When we moved into this house, I thought that, you know, the kids should have their own 1,000% chore chart. Like, we've been uh, telling the well, kids since day one, they got to do this. We've been here for a year without a chore chart. Wasn't going to happen, so... You know, as I'm cooking for the kids and cleaning and, you know, a lot of the stuff that you do, I said, let's put a chore chart together to help mom out. Take one, take a bunch of stuff off her plate. And, uh, yeah, she just got you nothing. <laughs> it would have been better. She got you. <laughs> it would have been better. Well, I honestly, I, I saw this and I was like, as in my thought, and this is what happened until you put the kibosh down. Oh, hey, sis. Was that... The boys did it for two days, and then it was it. Until the, actually this weekend, you threaten them with no Fortnite ever again if they don't stick to this chore chart. Well, we've got to make them do it. We have to make them do it. So that was like... It's there. They've done it. It's helpful. <laughs> <laughs> she, Audrey likes to play that she's the perfect gift giver. My 40th birthday party, I got a list of 40 things she was going to get me. <laughs> Didn't actually get me any of them, but it was a list of 40 things well, she was going to get me. In all fairness, you had just had surgery. I couldn't do oh, anything. Okay. But I did get you. I know I've never not gotten you anything. I didn't pout around all day. Oh, I did pout around all day because I felt, I felt as their Good mom, the, what, everything that I feel like that I do for this family, I literally felt like I deserved at least to be told you're getting a massage today. You're, you know, you're going away for the day. Again, Gigantic expectations for Mother's Day. And my takeaway from Mother's Day was this. Don't expect a lot. <laughs> Have, here is the expectation. Do not, because he loves to say too. You're not my mother. 
My mother was probably also disappointed on Mother's Day. I mean, <laughs> honest to God. I mean, I... I, oh, I I, I just it, so I, I wanted to put that out there. I hope that the moms Indeed out there semi understand what I'm talking about. I'm sure the dads out there Listen, will understand. Next year you're getting a vacuum cleaner for Mother's Day. Oh, for Day. Pete's sake! So, All right, so that's it. Marriage Monday. Every every Monday we're going to talk about some topic, but the topic at hand as we kick this off had to be about this Mother's Day chore chart. It had to be. The incredibly thoughtful <laughs> chore chart. God forbid we help you. Yeah. <laughs>